What's up, y'all? Kilo Nels here. You know what? I was thinking, man. After that last video with me talking about squatting every day, y'all showed me so much love on that. You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to run it back. But this time, I'm going to do it much better and more improved than last time. So Squat Every Day 2.0 starts right now. Let's get it. This time, we're going to run it back, but we're going to run it back smart and have an actual plan. Like, how are we going to squat every day? What's the plan? I'm going to break it down for y'all on this entire series. I'm going to bring y'all with me from diet, recovery, sets and reps day by day. When am I going heavy? When am I going light? I'm going to show y'all everything. All right. So take this ride with me on this journey. Squat every day. 2.0. I already did it that first time, and it was a shit show. <laughs> this time, we're coming with a better plan and more science, so y'all can possibly do it too, all right? Take this ride with me. So today was day one of Squat Every Day 2.0, and I already squatted on Saturday, and today's Monday, so I'm not going to count Saturday. So today is day one. My legs are still kind of sore from Saturday, so what I did was I hit the belt squat, I kept it easy, kept it simple. Like I said, we're going to play it smart this time, all right? So I did three sets of eight, and I put two plates or 245s on each side of the belt squat, and I got three sets of eight. And every time I did it, I made sure I'm hitting depth and I'm doing the squat correctly. While we're in this process, we're going to make sure we're still engraving good habits on our lips. No bad habits, nothing sloppy. If we're going to do it every day, we're going to become very efficient at this, all right? So if you go back and watch my last video when I'm talking about me doing this years ago when I was in my 20s, you'll see I was talking about having knee issues, having back issues, not recovering properly. This time, we're going to do things way differently. And we're going to be smart and wise. I'm 35 right now. People might think I'm crazy for even trying this again, but maybe I am crazy. <laughs> maybe I am. All right, coach. When you first met me, I was squatting every day, right? Right. So, <laughs> right now, if I'm like, hey, you know what? I want to do it again. What you would say? I'd be like, what the wrong with you? <laughs> <laughs> I'd say, why? Don't, why? Your knee, don't your knees feel good? Yeah. Don't your body feel pretty good? Yeah. And why would you want to go through that at 30, what, 5? Yeah, 35 oh years God. old. Oh, yeah. I would think you're crazy. Crazy? Yeah, I would think you're crazy. Damn. <laughs> but uh, if you said you were going to do it, uh -huh. I would say, okay, if you're going to do it, do it like this. I would try to tell you some kind of way to do it, a better way. Mm, okay, so you know what I mean? it's an actual plan to it. Right, exactly, yeah. Okay. Exactly, yeah. So it's like possible then. If, yeah, if you want to do something, if you're in, in this, your mind is just like made up, mm -hmm. and then you have to figure out the best way to do it. Yeah. Alright. You gotta have a game plan. Alright, bet. Alright, y'all. So tune in with me on this ride. It's gonna be a fun one. I'm gonna show y'all the good, the bad, the ugly. When I feel like doing it, when I don't feel like doing it, I'm gonna show y'all everything from how my body's changing. How's my diet? How's my sleep? How's my attitude? How's my mood? Am I snappy? Everything. Alright. I'm gonna show y'all the entire process. Alright. So tap in, subscribe, like, comment. Y'all been showing me so much love, man, and it's much appreciated. All right? Keep on tapping in. Kilo Nails, signing out. Peace. Let's go. Be free. As they let me eat, knew the streets was my expertise. I kept the street contacts with my connect, so they let me eat. A rapper, but I was a drug trafficker before I left the streets. These 10 more crack commandments. Frank Wright, rest in peace. Uh, number 20, gotta be to make sure that you count the money. Singles and fives out the hundreds, we call that bankroll a dummy. I've been on both sides of that, made a smooth relationship ugly. But dealing with a true connect, my first goal is get you to trust me. 19 is, don't never burn the plug, dog. that silly shit. I had to mention it. Since this one wasn't on Biggie list You know you have a hard time comprehending it I mean risking six figure minutes for pennies is kinda ridiculous 18, you better test that work before you buy it Yeah, of course they gon' say it's fire But you know these niggas be lying Me and Vines was OT with 80 racks But that's on the driver Drove back with the money Cause when it be tried it, he up and denied it 17, take care of the people around you They only appreciate how you Value what you eating, they eating beside you You a worker, the boss wouldn't be here without you 
hope you do the dirty work from the first to the 31st. But I see they forgot you. 16 hard for niggas, but you got a stack. You got some racks. Soon as your name started buzzing, you got attached. You should be spending that money. You're re up and not in sacks. It's only Real cool estate. being dressed in designer. Real the dollars match. The team is good one. Listen, most people confuse how we spend our